Hello and welcome back to Let's Talk by George. In today's video, we are going to review a app called Bharat Caller. Guys, honestly, this is an Indian alternative. This is an Indian app and it is an alternative to True Caller. Uh, right now, I have loaded the Play Store page in front of you. So let's have a look about the app section first before we proceed. So as I've already told you, Bharat Caller is a hundred percentage Indian call ID caller app to identify unknown callers. Right, that is great. Now I have installed the app to my mobile phone. So let's have a take a look at how the app is going to look like. I've already logged into the app. So let's launch the app first. Right, this is how the home screen looks like. Now before we proceed, the signing up process is similar to uh, what we have in Truecaller. Enter your phone, uh, enter your phone number. They will send an OTP to your number. Um, enter the OTP, give the name, blah blah blah. Give necessary permissions like uh, permissions to access your contacts and your logs messages. So it is the setup is similar or the setup is exactly same like Truecaller. There is um, nothing different in it. The thing is, you, you will get all the uh, local languages. I believe there are 14 languages available in the app. Even Malayalam is included. Malayalam is my home language or my mother tongue. Uh, it is included in the app. I cannot uh, take you through the entire user interface since I have a I have an issue like uh, it may uh, leak some numbers and also um, I don't prefer to do that. Basically, I will show you or I will give you a rough idea about the user inter user interface. So this is how the landing page looks like. I mean, as I've told you, it is exactly like true color. Only difference is that this is made in India and this is an Indian app. This is the only difference in it. Now um, to talk about the upsides, well, um, the company company uh, which makes the um, who makes the app claims that they don't store any customer information or the user in information on their server plus on top of that they guarantee us that their employees don't have access to any kind of database any kind of number uh, database that is stored in their server so they say this is a good opportunity i mean this is a good app and uh, they respect your privacy plus on top of that it gives you a indian feel a bharat feel a home feel for you when you have um, these kind of apps i also did a review on rti app which is uh, which can be an alternative to telegram and uh, whatsapp please make sure that you watch I, I watch the video i will post the video link on my on the description of this video and you can check the card up above if you wish to watch it now to talk about the upside i have already mentioned to you um, this is an indian app and uh, i cannot uh, make a judgment right now since it was published on 15th of august this year i mean 2021 so there is going to be a lot of drawback or a lot of problem with the app since the app is fairly new and they are trying to expand their database as you already know that there are two calls which happened from my mobile it was yeah it was some kind today i mean no it was yesterday basically but they they say today please note if if anyone from the uh, app development team watches it so i don't know something has happened these two calls were made yesterday so you are displaying it uh, wrong anyway no problem this is new um basically the second number the uk right unknown number listed over here which was which is an airtel customer care number so basically uh, they have a problem with their database the database is not yet complete i believe so that is why they are uh, telling that this is an unknown number but uh, luckily truecaller was able to identify the number so this is a drawback i mean their database is not yet completed so if you are trying to rely completely on this app you might have some troubles since uh, the database need a little bit more work so what i'm going to do is i'm going to uh, help them by reporting it as spam so business sales save right so that is over there right. now um, a couple of things about the app 
as i've told you this is an indian app and it is a fairly new app we need to allow the developer to um, some more time to really develop their database and rectify some of the bugs if there are a way if, if something if some are there till now i have not noticed any bug uh, how does it work well it displays the same pattern as of true caller so once you get a call you will see a blue uh, blue thing a blue uh, window or a blue overlay coming up on your screen telling that who is calling similarly the same thing happens over here i wish to test the app fully but there are some limitations from my side also i'm not very good at editing so i don't know how to hide the numbers and all i don't want to leak my numbers uh, <laughs> globally because a lot of people watch youtube so i don't want to get any spam calls that is the reason why i'm not testing the app to its full efficiency uh, but i can guarantee you one thing that this can be i mean i'm just telling or it's my guess it can be an alternative a good alternative to um, true caller if they are uh, expanding their database and if they are giving uh, smart service like what true caller does i wish every success to the app and a big thumbs up to the creator of this app for coming up uh, with an idea of developing a indian app and an alternative to true caller because till date i was looking for an alternative to true caller i haven't uh, found an uh, found a good alternative to it i wish every success for this app and let this be the perfect alternative to true caller Once again thank you for watching let's talk by George please stay tuned to this channel for more videos and reviews updates thank you very much